Ooh, I think I broke Pokemon Go after hitting the XP cap. Yep, because you guys can see on the title of the video, that is just an insane number over there. And that is actually the XP cap of this game. So hi, hi to all of you guys. So let me go ahead to bring my screen up and I want to let you guys know that I was actually making my way back home and then I noticed my total XP that something was really, really wrong. Let me show you guys what I mean. Okay, so I'm going to scroll down. You guys can see my XP over there. Negative 2,147,080,000. Eight hundred and fifty-three. All right, negative. Like, why is there a negative there? Well, I'll explain to you guys uh, why is there a negative over there, and also why the title is like that. Because uh, I'm gonna show you guys what happens when I continue to gain more XP. So remember the last five digits, eighty-two thousand eight hundred and fifty-three. Okay, we're gonna catch. Uh, all right, this blitz over here. <sighs> Let's see what happened, okay? I'm gonna do an excellent throw on it. Hopefully it hits. And you guys will see the amount of XP I'm going to gain, okay? So remember, yeah, 82,853. We caught the Blitzo, and we got 5,340 XP from that catch, all right? So by right, the number should go up to, you know, like 80, 7,000, you know, or 88,000. But if you were to scroll down and see, the number went down to 77,513. It's because every XP that I gain right now, in a way, it becomes a negative value added to my total XP already. So, we can firmly say that history has been made today that the XP cap has been reached, all right? And after playing this game for four and a half years, trying to like crack the XP, and a lot of players have been asking me like, have I reached the XP cap? Is my XP still going up? Well, when I hit 1 billion XP, um, it still went up to 2 billion. When I hit 2 billion, it still went up to currently right now to 2 billion, 147 million. And right now it is going down, but in theory is actually going up all right so what i mean by that on the title of the screen let me go ahead to show you guys my safari and you guys can see this okay you guys can google it yourself 32 bit integer max value all right so under wikipedia you guys can see it. the number 2 billion 147 million 483,647 is the maximum po positive value for a 32-bit signed binary integer in computing. It is therefore the maximum value for variables declared as integers in many programming languages and the maximum possible score, money, etc. So just to give you guys another example of a previous game that I played, Maple Story. Yep, I did play Maple Story for those of you who actually played Maple Story. Well, it was my childhood game in a sense. I played that when I was a teenager. And the maximum amount of the in-game currency, the mesos that you can actually keep on your account at a point of time per account is actually the same number, 2.147B. All right, or 2,147,483,647. All right, it's a mouthful, but that's the exact value that you can actually uh, keep. And uh, that has also happened for me here in Pokemon Go, man. So, um, I mean, you can say that that is actually the maximum amount of XP that we are able to get. And you guys can see the XP just went down a bit more because I guess my egg hatched. All right, yeah, my egg hatched. And of course, that contributes to XP or so. Okay, so uh, yeah, we're gonna see an Electrite hatch, really awesome, and I have enough Candy XL right now to actually max out a level 50 Electrite. In fact, my Shando uh, Manetric already, uh, just to clarify one thing, that uh, Shando Manetric video, that wasn't my first ever Shando, I actually uh, made a mistake, that's my second ever Shando Mega Evolution. My first ever Shando Mega Evolved Pokemon was my Mega Beedrill, but anyway, back to this. So, yeah, let's go ahead and take a look at the XP again. Like I said, you know, it's 
going down, but like I said, in theory, it's actually going up. So let's go ahead to catch another whooper. Okay, to see that the number will go up. In fact, you know what? I, I should actually just spin a Pokestop instead. All right, so every Pokestop that we spin would actually uh, give us 100 XP, but because it's going to be my first spin of the day, it would give me more XP. So 75,513. Let's go ahead to spin this XP. I mean, this Pokestop and gain some XP. Okay. Yeah, 72,313. Very interesting. When I saw the negative sign in front of the XP, I'm like, whoa. <laughs> My first reaction was like, whoa. <laughs> and you know, I was walking home alone and I, when I saw that, my eyes just, whoa, there's like a line before the number. And I eventually forced closed the app. I thought it was a glitch or whatsoever. I forced closed the app, I came back and it's still there, all right? The, the, the number did not, I mean, go back to positive, it's still negative. And I, I'm just very intrigued, all right? I'm just very intrigued. I'm just very, very mesmerized by this. And wow, <laughs> to actually hit the XP cap in Pokemon Go is actually pretty amazing. I mean, uh, playing this game for four and a half years, like I said, many people have been wondering whether, you know, 100 million XP was the cap for the XP or Hitting a billion XP was the cap for the XP or 2 billion XP was the cap for the XP. Nobody knows. Until right now where we can firmly say that, you know, the, you know, maximum 32 uh, bit divide, uh, sign binary integer is actually the max value you can possibly get. 2 billion, 147 million. Um, yeah, I need to refer to the, the thing, guys. 483,647, okay? Oh, it's kind of overwhelming for me right now. I know you guys may feel like, oh, okay, Brandon, it's just another number, but to even hit 1 billion XP here in Pokemon Go is just insane. And to get it up by two times to 2 billion is just even more insane. But to hit the maximum possible XP value just makes it really more fulfilling and worthwhile for myself because I actually like to figure out like what is the maximum amount for certain things. And of course, yeah, hitting this in a way milestone to me is actually quite uh, huge and I just want to put it out there that you know it has been really crazy in terms of gaining XP for the last few years especially since you know uh, remote rates was a thing and of course friendship like getting ultra friends or best friends XP etc is just insane in terms of the amount of XP that we are gaining but I know some of you guys will be Saying to yourself, oh my god, see, I got a few eggs that are about to hatch. Alright, let, let, let's let's see that. <laughs> you guys saw that the XP dropped to like 56,000, alright? So, in just a matter of days, as I still continue to like raid and play Pokemon Go, the number will just keep going down and going down and probably even go down to like negative under 2 billion, maybe negative 1.9 billion on my server. And some people, some of my friends have been saying, hey, you know, um, your next target is 3 billion XP, right? Looks like not. I won't be able to hit uh, 3 billion XP um, other than uh, if I were to gain another, you know, like 800 and something million, 800 and, I don't know, 50, 50 what, 53 million, um, which the number will bring it down to like negative, uh, let me see, neg negative 1 billion 294 <laughs> million yep i actually did the calculation on my phone and that means that one has hit 3 billion xp on pokemon go but <laughs> it's just insane and like i said my xp is going down even when i'm you know gaining xp in a sense yep can do it once more again we will catch the dealing uh-huh we're gonna let's see oh we will just throw a great throw okay we'll just throw a great throw <sighs> it's really satisfying guys to actually be able to hit this milestone and uh, yeah see that this <laughs> happens I mean I've hit the max level before on games like Clash of Clans and of course you know for me to hit this on Pokemon Go this uh, max XP is just truly remarkable so wow I wonder what's the next milestone for me, man. What, negative 1 billion XP now? Hmm. 
I think that might be the case guys negative 1 billion XP might be the next goal otherwise you know we might have to wait for Niantic to um, fix this and make it possible for us to surpass 2.147b yeah because uh, it's currently not possible to to do so yeah so I mean we will see how in the next few days and next few weeks and also the next few months uh, how it goes man for those of you who want to know how the number is going to be like in the next few uh, weeks or next few months well stay tuned for it man and also to subscribe if you guys ain't subscribed yet because i do upload daily pokemon go content and to see this insane number yeah it's just insane i know some of you guys might be commenting in the comment section hey it must be a glitch this must be fake or whatsoever well, if you don't believe me, try to reach this number, man, because uh, I don't think there's anyone in the world right now who has reached this number. And, uh, well, you can always uh, catch my uh, future videos to see that this number will still stick as negative or true unless Niantic does something about it to make a change to it, man. Yeah, so that is all that I have to show to you guys. It's just a very short and simple video of me uh, sharing my thoughts and uh, experience in terms of reaching this <laughs> crazy... Uh, experience a uh, cap in pokemon go 2 billion 147 million 483,647 all right i think i got the number memorized down let me just take a double check on it yeah okay i i, I got it 2147483647 that's the number that <laughs> we can reach here in pokemon go so okay, with that said, I'd like to thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next episode in the next video for more insane Pokemon Go, okay? Alright, goodbye, goodbye, goodbye! And don't forget, the grind never stops. Anyway, I'm gonna go and grind now, as in, gonna head out to go and do my night grind, my night walk. Alright, goodbye, goodbye, goodbye!